you create a theme just to make things look reasonable. Creating trivial hello world UI. Click Generate NetBeans Project. We can pick the main form. Here we have only one form to pick from. Project name is the directory name of the project. Pick the folder to which the project will be generated. Point at the NetBeans executable so the IDE can be invoked with project files. Four projects are created, common for all ports. Desktop specific, mid specific and RIM Blackberry specific. The desktop version is useful for prototyping, debugging and demoing your application. It also includes an applet version allowing for live application demos. The mid -p slash rim versions allow running building for the respective device families. Platform specific code can be placed in these project hierarchies. The state machine base class is generated every time you save your resource file and contains code mapping from the resource file to Java. Do not modify this class, it will be overwritten. State machine derives from state machine base and it's where your code should reside. We now bind event code to the button by clicking the action event button. This button overrides the appropriate method in the generated class to receive button press code. Besides action events, we can also bind callbacks for form creation, exit, show, and for list model construction. 